Hello YouTubers and welcome to another episode. Today we're going to talk about training at the training centre and the differences between Leander Club training and this training. And obviously the first thing is we do weights here at Bisham Abbey Sports Centre. So we do weights here rather than in the one building like at Leander Club. But now it's time to drive safely back to Cavisham for the training centre. Oh yeah. And we've made it to Cavisham. It is a beautiful day. Unfortunately, on this beautiful day, I have a migraine. So for me, a migraine, I get the aura in my eyes. And if I don't take some ibuprofen quick enough, I end up feeling very nauseous, very sore head. And then that'll disappear eventually. Morning. And if that doesn't disappear, then I'm out for the day. So I get very sensitive eyes. So the sun. It is excellent on the eyes there, and it'll probably end up throwing up at some point. But we'll deal with it. It seems to be fading, but we will soon find out if it completely fades. But like we was talking about differences between Cavisham, this drive from Bisham to Cavisham is a big thing. It takes half an hour roughly, and is takes a chunk out of recovery. So you have to consider that when you're preparing for the day, little snacks for the drive here. But now it's time to fuel up properly for breakfast with some breaded egg toast. Because remember, food is fuel. <laughs> and we've made it into the crew room. We've got the breaded egg toast slash bagel edition. Had an interesting little throw up there. Pre-post migraine. Hopefully that is it all finished. Basically, like I said, the throw up is kind of the last stage of said migraine. But now, Hopefully, I can fuel up a little bit to finish this off. Oh yeah! <laughs> To the Cavisham crew room once more. We've got some delicious lasagna and salad with a flapjack, and we've got a discussion about what is too much food and what is not enough food. Always very interesting. That's one of the differences between Cavisham and Leander. The food here is different. It's a very high quality, as is the Leander food. That is. And. But sometimes it's a bit of smaller portions, so you have to adjust what you're eating and eat some more, eat some, or eat more throughout the day, or eat less throughout the day. But it's still very delicious. <laughs> and remember, food is fuel, so let's get it to it. And we've made it outside of Cavisham, outside the training centre, for another day. Pretty good session on the water with Mr. Shoto. Great food as well. And another difference for rowing at Leander versus rowing, or Another difference of rowing at Leander versus rowing at Cavisham, it is a lake and not a river. So with the lake, there's no stream and it's more consistent. And then when you go out on the river, you get your stream, you get the inconsistencies of a river. There's Tom Ford and all of the issues that that can produce. And sometimes it's a bit annoying and you're like, oh, why is the boat going this way or that way? But then you have to realise it's due to the river itself. And we've got the Yam Squad Christmas merch, which has finally arrived. We're going to package that up tonight and then hopefully get it sent out tomorrow and get that sent to you guys for before Christmas. We're going to make sure, we're going to make sure we we'll get the faster postage for you guys that are further afield, like the Australians and Americans, so that we do get Christmas merch 
for Christmas. Oh yeah, but now it is time to go home, chill out, eat food, relax, because remember, food is fuel and recovery is key to success. So, as always, Jam Squad, remember to subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that like button and have a good one.